Israel Adesanya is an incredibly skilled and technical fighter as he's a striking expert, which makes him extremely accomplished in the world of MMA and a master of his craft. In his last collision against Alex Pereira, he has proven why he's arguably the king of the middleweight. Alex was an aggressor that throws devastating strikes and he did hurt Adesanya with the calf kicks. But for him being an attacker is what had him coach with the huge counter. Because Silbender was more calculated and patient to wait for the right moment to unleash the devastating right hand that put Alex Pereira's lights out. And once again, Adesanya has been crowned as the middleweight king. Now, let's take a look at the techniques he uses. Stylebender is a switch stance fighter. He's so skilled and slick that he can fight exceptionally well from both stances. This gives him the benefit of giving a different look to his opponent. Like when Alex put the damage on his left calf, he was able to switch from orthodox to a southpaw. Adesanya's dynamic style of striking is not only what makes him exceptional, it's also the few small things he does to hide his strikes and make him unpredictable, like the feints. The movements he uses to deceive his opponents so they have no idea what he's about to attack. Like, he doesn't throw a flimsy half jab to fake the shot, he just makes a half step forward and thrusting his shoulder out. Usually this will draw some sort of reaction, whether it's a flinch or it's the opponent's jab counter. From the shoulder feint he will come up with a real jab, and follow with additional strikes and start hitting the opponent. Then uses this as the basis of his second major technique, the rear hip feint. This is primary focus to disguise the low kick, however there is more to it than that. This technique confuses the opponent because it's very hard to tell whether a rear kick or a rear straight punch is coming to the opponent, meaning that the hip feint is not only making the opponent feel the kick, it's also serving the secondary purpose of disguising the rear straight punch. One of the great techniques that Adesanya uses with effectiveness is the question mark kick. This is when the opponent sees Adesanya's round kick coming his way. There is no guarantee he's actually going to be hit with it, so he will end up eating a head kick. Israel Adesanya has used it multiple times with effectiveness. He also recorded a knockout finish with this iconic move. These techniques together make Israel Adesanya a great pressure fighter and also hard to read, so the opponents can no longer be reactive. Adesanya's striking skill is not only the techniques he throws, but also his shot selection and cage craft. Beside his technical skills, his mental game makes him such a formidable champion, and that's why he's one of the best strikers in the world of combat sports today. If you liked the video, please don't forget to support us with like and subscribe, and thank you for watching.